Now from the 19, Buckeye police are investigating allegations of sexual offenses against children involving a photographer who was contracted for school pictures. Police say the alleged crimes happened on September the 2nd. In a letter to families, the Liberty Elementary School District says the photographer was on the Freedom Elementary School campus last month. Team 12's Adriana Loya is here now with the latest on the investigation. Well, guys, that photographer who was contracted by the school has not been identified yet, and so far no charges have been filed against them. Although information is limited, Buckeye police did say that the alleged sexual offenses against minors happened on September 2nd. An investigation now underway in Buckeye after authorities say someone reported to police that a photographer committed sexual offenses against minors. Just unbelievable. In a message to parents, the superintendent of Liberty Elementary School District said Buckeye police notified them about allegations against a photographer the district had used for students' pictures. Investigators tell 12 News the allegations were reported by an individual on September 2nd. That's the same day the inappropriate behavior allegedly occurred. We found that's also the same day the school had picture day. That's unacceptable. Xavier Cabrera is a parent of four. Although his kids don't go to Freedom Elementary, he's concerned about the allegations. That has to be traumatizing for those kids at least. So, I mean, to hear that that's happening is kind of like, what is this? What, what, how do they vet these people? How do they find this person? Do they not do a background check on him? I mean, a lot of questions that need to be answered. The district said it canceled a scheduled retake day of school pictures involving the photographer and is putting on hold any future contracts with that company. In a statement, the superintendent said one of the most difficult things about these situations is that information is very limited, adding we will not tolerate behaviors that compromise the safety of our children. And Baca police say they are still in the early stages of this investigation and they are currently in the process of conducting several interviews. In Bacay, Adriana Loya, 12 News.